Back-to-back -back tests between model and code are highly recommended by the ISO 262 standard, but preparing and executing a back-to-back -back test can become quite challenging, especially in larger projects. Not only is it difficult to build up enough test data to ensure completeness, but also the execution in comparison between the model and code is often not intuitive or efficient. BTC Embedded Platform manages this challenge automatically with 100% completeness and 0% manual effort. In this example, we've already opened up a test project that contains a Simulink model, the auto-generated code, and a set of automatically generated tests. So let's now create a back-to-back -back test. In this dialog, we can select the test data that will be applied on our system under test as well as the execution levels we want to compare. The test data will then be applied on both levels in order to judge whether or not the two instances behave the same. For our back-to-back -back test, we will run mill against sill. If needed, it's also possible to define certain tolerances to consider for later comparison. When the tool detects deviations during the back-to-back -back test, it will automatically display them. In order to have a closer look at them, we can either view the test results in BTC Test Composer, create a debug environment, or generate an HTML report. We hope you enjoyed this video of BTC Embedded Platform. Please also have a look at our other videos, and don't hesitate to contact us if you have any further questions.